Hi, welcome back to The Average. Today we're going to be checking out these Crayola glitter dots, which I've never heard of before, but they look super squishy and I don't know, I just want to try them out. I didn't really want to try out like this glass stain effect, I just want to see how they work and if it's a total waste of money. I also got this set, which is like a fun little kid set with all like these little bits, but probably not going to be using them because I have an idea of what I want to use these glitter dots for if they work. I'm hoping that they do. But yeah, you've seen the title. Basically, I have one of these, which I'm very proud of. So, you know, I was very sad to see that in a move I had obviously like dinked it here somehow quite badly. There's you. So I want to see if I can cover up this little area with some of these glitter dots. I do have an idea in mind of what I want to kind of do. I want to have it like dripping down it somehow something like that but i want to get on and see if these glitter dots actually work on metal which i'm not sure they will so either we'll glue them or we'll see what happens let's open this one first because i'm excited to just get into these these are the kind of things that when i was a kid i would be like uh yeah give me that give me them all and uh <laughs> I don't know if it's worth it because maybe it's just like a l bunch of glitter in some oh my nail just completely smudged off brilliant classic anyway this is the dots that it comes with not very many to be honest so this small set was about 10 pounds and you get how many dots 42 dots of it which is not you know it's a little bit stingy i guess most of the money goes into these little like key rings you can make with the dots which is kind of cute um might make a little pesto yeah those are quite cute i might give it to um a niece or something to play with and then also this station which by the way when i first bought this i just bought them because i wanted to try them out and then i realized i wanted to use the dots on that um award so i bought this before i knew that so these things are obviously not going to be used so in this one eh, can't open it need a knife don't ask me why i have a giant bread knife near me it just is the way it is you open oh my god dangerous i did it everyone can breathe so obviously this one is a bigger set this one's a bit cheeky with the way it's like made it stand up like that and uh, it comes with more colors so i don't know if these these aren't the same colors right because i thought they would be different colors and now i'm kind of seeing that maybe they are the same colors oops well, okay okay we can deal with it and then you get all these little like bits and bobs which obviously you can eat oh you can build your own okay that's kind of cool <laughs> the inner child in me is like what so you can build your own bit of that you can build your own bit of that okay so these are pretty cute then you get loads of shapes it's kind of good if you want to make cookies so this pack comes with what shiny paper yeah, so what you do is that you squish it down and then you can mess around with it. So I don't know if this is going to be permanent, which is kind of what I was hoping for. But, you know, maybe I'll just have to put a load of, like, varnish over the top. Okay, I want to get one out because I've been dying to try these. All right, let's test them out. I'm going to do a yellow dot first. And I'm really hoping that I could just push them through, but I don't think that's the case. I think I have to peel away this bit. But you could pop them like a pill, but you can't. Okay, first glob of glitter. Here we go. Let's smoosh it down just like God intended. Okay. Okay. It's not quite going down. I've got it on the smooth surface as well. Maybe I should try some like paper. So if you wanted to like play with it, I guess. And then you could also stick it down on paper. Ooh, yes. No, I'm like, am I liking this? I think I'm liking this. I might have to put down some like Mod Podge on the, the uh, 100,000 award <laughs> uh, first. But yeah, this is kind of looking like how I want it to. Um, what I like, want to do is have it as if it's dripping down the award. So I want to see if I can like sculpt per se. It's not really sculpting, is it? But you know what I mean? Okay, it's kind of like just coming back up, so let's just take it back. Take it back now. Oh no, I'm gonna get glitter <laughs> everywhere, aren't I? Oh, was this a giant mistake? Could have been. Let's try and see if I can use some modeling paste. And then, whilst the modeling paste dries, or I don't know, once it's dry, we can see how that works. 
So I've got a modeling paste, right? Okay, let's just try it on wet, smoosh it down and see if it sticks. I'm going to try this. I'm going to try some Stuart Semple coat over the top of this blob and see if it like sticks it down. I can tell that this is probably going to be more of a nightmare project than I had once predicted and I'm kind of regretting it, but it might be fun. <laughs> no, I have regrets. Back in five. One week later. Yeah. Um, so it's like, I don't know, two weeks later. I was going to abandon this video because I thought it looks so bad and the idea that I had was obviously not working out because these things aren't great and they weren't great for paper so I can imagine them not being great for like metal metallic surfaces but I wanted to give them a real shot before I um, decide that they're utter rubbish it's kind of like a dried up crayon I don't know oh also this is how this turned out it doesn't look great kind of looks okay underneath but it, it does flake off still and then this coat stuff it, it's kind of mattifying which it does say there so that that is my bad i didn't want a mattifying thing for glitter do i so it doesn't really work experiment didn't work and this just this stuff just comes off i think it's so that you can reuse it but i don't really get it i just what's what's the point then if you're going to decorate a whole box do you want this stuff to fall off i'm getting annoyed with it <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling like, um, what's her name? Nerdy Crafter when she like, maybe it's just the yellow. Like maybe I need to branch out and try a different color. Also, I really wanted this to be able to like pop out. No, it doesn't because it's too soft. It says peel to open. You see, you have to, even though it looks like it should be poppable. Very, uh, very unsatisfied by this project. I really wanted to be like so satisfying and fun. I like fun little balls of glitter though. That's cute, but okay. No, it's just a set. Like, have I done it wrong? Like, th this is crap. This is honestly rubbish. Like, this is the, the thing that they gave us, by the way. The box inside. What? It doesn't even work on that. No, it literally says just to, like, squish. And it's, like, it's, like, fun without the mess. Except the mess is there. It's called whatever this is. I'm trying to think what else you could use them for. Because I do have a load of them. And they're not even like crayony or anything like Crayola. They're just terrible. Don't buy these. They look really satisfying and I thought they were going to be really fun, but they're not. They've just made me a little bit sad. You know what? I'm abandoning this. <laughs> okay, well, thanks. Thanks for this. I don't want to do this now. I have to throw it away. Right, but what I do want to do, because I don't want to abandon this video, my lovely award that I've ruined because I am absolutely, obviously, just awful. Um, I want to cover it with glitter then instead because I bought some glitter and uh, it looks like this. I thought that would be cute just to like cover this area. But then I'm also like, would it be cute? Would it be cute? But um, for the sake of the video, I'm going to do it. I bought some Gorilla gl Glue. Gorilla Glue. So that's glitter won't move. And what I want to do is go for my dripping effect that I thought of originally with these dots which was very ambitious of me obviously extremely ambitious considering it won't even stick to paper oh i just i went for it okay i want it to like just be really weird and drippy does that make sense like as if it's paint and then like obviously i want it to go over this bit where the scratches are and then i'll do like a little dot kind of makes sense right you know for me being a, a an art youtuber i don't know whether to add more i think i'll just like do a little bit like here yeah so yeah i've got two packets of this and i've got my gorilla glue we're ready to go i'm very scared but let's do it i had a little think and i realized i don't want to do it straight onto the award without testing it so i found this can i don't drink this by the way this got sent for us for free for some reason in a delivery so it's like okay thanks but yeah i'm just gonna <laughs> test it on this can to see if it's like a similar or just you know what happens okay um because just just to be extra safe i guess also i'm very scared of getting glitter everywhere which i know is gonna happen okay let's just sprinkle it on i should put a piece of paper underneath so i can save bits there you go that's what this test was for so i could see this mistake before i went for it <laughs> and it looks kind of cute actually so let's see maybe it will look really cute on the on the sign. Cute little rocks. <laughs> Juicy. <clears throat> okay, let's try and save 
this little bit of glitter. All right, let's begin. I think anything, like even if it looks a bit weird, it's gonna look better than this giant scratch, right? It dries clear as well, which is really handy. Maybe I'm doing too much glue first. I feel like I need a little spatula or something. And I do have one. A little bit dirty though, so let's just clean that off. <laughs> it's still dirty, but you know. <laughs> we get by, we get by. Okay, let's see. Cute, cute. What are we thinking so far? Bet you didn't think you were gonna have a little craft project for me, did you? I'm not a very crafty person. But yeah, I want it like a little bit lumpy. What do we think so far? What do we think? And let's do this little splodge in here. Oh no, I did too much glue. Okay, it's fine. This is what it is, guys. This is what it is. It's gonna be a glitter, like as if a glitter thing had fallen onto the award. That's the vibe we're going with. So it's, go it's gonna work. Just get the excess off a little bit. Well, we'll see what it looks like once it's dry. Cause I'll, uh oh, <laughs> it's stuck to my hands. Well, we'll see. We'll see how I get that off. In the next episode of Blunders, I think if I just cover it like that. <laughs> Steadily move this paper around. There we go, there we go. Okay. Um. <laughs> now we just wait for it to dry, I guess, and then I will try and like remove the excess. It looks kind of cute in here as well. Should I put a little bit in the mirror? No, no, it will look nicer clean. Let's just wait for it to dry. Um, that for you will take no time at all. For me, it'll probably take a couple of hours. So let's see. I don't know why I clapped. And here is the final result. What do you guys think? I'm really happy with it. I really like it. I'm glad that the dots didn't work out because I think in the end this looks so much nicer. And I'm really happy that I managed to cover up like that big dent in this award. And I think it looks really cute and I think it suits the, uh, the style of the channel as well. So let me know what you guys think. And uh, <laughs> reminder, don't buy these dot things. I also have another set here. They're just awful. I was thinking about giving these to a niece or something. Um, but they're just like frustrating to use. I don't really get it. It's not really, it's just crap. So don't bother. But thanks for watching guys. And uh, thanks for this award, I guess, because it's all down to you. That was super cheesy, but thank you. And uh, I hope to see you next time. Bye.